fuel oil transfer system comprises of the following port side bunker manifold starboard side bunker manifold number 1 hfo storage tank port side number 2 hfo storage tank starboard side diesel oil storage tank hfo settling tank diesel oil service tank fuel oil overflow or leak tank hfo transfer pump diesel oil transfer pump quick closing valves vending arrangements drain valves high level and low level sensors for alarm cut in and cut out switches now let us see how the hfo transfer pump works as the low level cut in switch in the settling tank actuate the hfo transfer pump starts the fuel starts flowing from hfo storage tank to settling tank the system comprises of a filter which has to be cleaned thoroughly before changing over bunker tank try not to mix fuel from different bunker tank while topping up settling tank the settling tank has a special design by which it can separate water present in fuel by gravity this water has to be drained out by drain valves as shown in the diagram when the high level cutout switch actuates the pump stops and hence the transfer stops the same operation can be done in manual mode also Now let us see how the diesel oil service tank is built. In the same manner as above, when the low level cut in switch actuates, the diesel oil transfer pump starts. The fuel starts flowing from diesel oil storage tank to diesel oil service tank via filter as shown in the video. When the high level cut off switch actuates, the pump stops and thus the transfer also stops. Now let us see what happens when the high level cut off switch doesn't function for an hfo settling tank the settling tank continues to get filled up the high level sensors activates and raises an alarm excess fuel starts flowing into the overflow tank once you hear the high level alarm immediately acknowledge the alarm and stop the hfo transfer pump if you neglect it the overflow tank will also get filled up and give another alarm and still if not attended it will start spilling through your vent heads in the upper deck so always be cautious while doing transfers of fuel it is always recommended to test all the alarms once in a month so i hope now you have understood the transfer operations of fuel and hazards which can occur due to negligence thank you